For years, the hockey rink has been nothing more than an arena for 17-year-old Tyler Morad. However, when Tyler lost his brother Cameron Morad to heart failure last November, the rink became a sanctuary, a place where he could embrace his talent and let his troubles melt away. But the loss of his brother was a tragedy Tyler and his family never could have anticipated. I saw him in the casket, and that was when I really broke down and like when I really cried for the first time. As difficult as it was to get back into his normal routine, Tyler showed no hesitation in returning to the sport he loved. My coaches and my teammates really said, you know, Tyler, it's all up to you whether you want to come back in a month or a year or never. And I said, you know what, I'll, I want to come back on Monday. The death of his brother shook his world, but there was still one place where Tyler could find peace. When I was at home those few days, all I thought about was, you know, the negatives and how he's not here anymore. And when I went to practice, I was able to think about all the great things he did in his life and how much he influenced me in a positive way and how I wouldn't even be there if it wasn't for him. Even the support he received from friends and family could not compare to the peace of mind he found when in the rink. Being on the ice kind of took Tyler's mind off of what he was experiencing and just gave him an outlet. Blocking all of my, my logical thinking and my reasoning allowed me to kind of get into a different state of mind. His new mentality allowed him to come back a changed player. The teammates who had played a pivotal role in encouraging Tyler's return noticed a shift in both the mental and physical aspects of his game. I did see a change in him and from hockey he really had a fire in his eyes and you could see the motivation. Returning to hockey has connected Tyler to his brother Cameron, motivating him to carry on. Every time I step onto the ice now, I'm not just playing for myself or my team, I'm really playing for Cameron and I know that if he were here, he would want me to do the same thing. Tyler has since found ways to embrace Cameron on and off the ice. He wears a bracelet that reads, Cameron Morad, we love you, as a constant reminder of what Cameron meant to him. I haven't taken it off since November 8th because I love to look down at this and remember him and say, everything that I do is for him. The memory of his brother and his love for the sport has affirmed Tyler's desire to press on. Hockey really allowed me to come to the realization that there is a reason to push on and, you know, not dwell in the past. You can bounce back. As Tyler continues to push on, it is clear that his return to hockey has redefined his disposition. For West Ranch Television, this has been Matt Palmer reporting.